Welcome everybody to my first Animal Crossing video. This is going to be a daily routine. My daily routine. Here we go. All right. So the first thing I do when I get on my island is go through my daily routine. And this is it. Check my mailbox. Grab any items that I purchased from the store. Here we go. It's got some book stands. Elephant slide. Okay. Grab these books. Now, the first thing I do after checking my mailbox is I'm going to hunt for the DIY. The message in the, which is found in the message in the bottle. So we just comb these beaches. I'll grab these shells while we're at it. And I'll head this way looking for the message in a bottle. And we found it already. They're perfect. All right. So we got the message in the bottle. Check it out. What did we get? Yeah, hanging terrarium. I don't think I have this one. Hmm, okay, sweet. I learned a new recipe for a hanging terrarium. Perfect. All right. So, while combing the beaches, um, I'm also looking for the money spot as well as fossils. So, I'm just running up here. And now, I'll just run around this little area here and there's a fossil right there so I'll grab that all right perfect got a fossil and I'll head back down this way where we started and I'll just run back down here a little bit towards my house and that basically takes care of the left side of my island all right we found the diy normally i'd have to go around my entire island looking for the diy so i'd, I'd get a lot more uh a lot more found but after i've got the diy the next thing i'm gonna do is go shake my trees now i use the net and what you're gonna do is you're gonna shake hardwood trees now if you notice around here there's no hardwood trees there are money trees uh, this is a growing money tree. It's not a full size yet. It'll be a money tree, full grown money tree next. But around here, it's all fruit trees or money trees with money on them. And the reason for that is hardwood trees spawn an item when you shake them. Let's try it. Shake it. Boom. Got some money. Now there's three different things you can get. You can get some money. You get a wasp's nest and bees. Or you'll get furniture item and you can get up to two furniture items from your hardwood trees there we go not another coin now the bees people are usually afraid of so they don't really enjoy shaking all these trees all the time but if you keep your net in your hand walk up to the tree like this push a one time to shake the tree and if a bee comes out you automatically face the bee as soon as the surprise uh, reaction goes away hit a you'll catch the B there we go we got one surprise reaction hit a catch the B you don't have to face the bees you don't have to turn your joystick nothing you automatically face the B you just hit a so it's pretty safe as long as you have a net hit the B got a coin so we're on our way along this path well so I have this path here which follows all my hardwood trees so what I'm doing is while I'm following this path, shaking my hardwood trees, I'm looking for the money spot as well as fossils. We'll go up here. Oh, hello. And there's one area over here, which I don't have hardwood trees, but just checking for the money spot or any fossils. Nothing. Okay, so just head back over here. And back to the trees. Shake, bees. Automatically faces, reaction, A button. Easy as pie. Now these bees, they sell for a lot of money. Um, can't think it's, I think it's 2,300. And red's here. Oh, red's here today. So that's a good thing. So again, my path comes all the way up here so that I'll know when red is here when I'm doing my routine. So we're still looking for fossils and the money spot. While shaking these trees, another bee. 
Hey. Got it. I caught a wasp. Sorry, it's a wasp, not a bee. <laughs> oh no. I'm gonna have to swap it. I don't wanna let it go. <laughs> I'll get stung. My inventory is full. Oh no. What should I do? Okay, I'll just drop this. Swap. I haven't found the items yet. What am I gonna do? Let me let me check my inventory. What's going on here? I didn't envy I didn't empty it before today. I started today. That's the problem. I'm so sorry. Alright, so we'll follow this fast. We still need to we need to continue from here. Find the two items. And I'll just there you go. So there's an item. So this is a coffee grinder. So I'm gonna pick that up. And I will just swap it for rocks or something like that. Swap it. Uh, get rid of these rocks. Drop them. I'll come pick them up later. And I'll just continue along here. And there's the second item. So after I found both of these um, items, pedal board, I would usually stop shaking my trees. So that's the main thing I'm looking for is these items. These, uh, let's drop this hardwood. These two furniture items. All right, but I'll show you the routine. I'll continue on the path because I still would follow my path because like I said, I'm still looking for fossils. Hey, a bottle. I answered. Welcome. I'm still looking for the money spot. And I'm still looking for fossil. So just follow. This is my path. There's a fossil. Grab that. Just to show you what I would do. Normally, I would have an empty inventory. <laughs> it's my fault. All right. Swap it. I'll get rid of What else can we get rid of here today? Here it is. I'll just come back. Okay. Still no money. Tree. No money spot yet. Come down here. Down here. Oh, there's another fossil. My my inventory is quite full, so for the money spot don't see it all right around here there's another fossil got two fossils one there one there money spots probably right over here so right down here is i don't have any grass down here just goes back down to my beaches so usually there we go we got the money spot now, what you're going to do with the money here, you know what? Let's go get this is. Let me just drop some stuff. here. I'll just drop some stuff here. I'll drop. Drop these items here. OK. So this is my routine. All right. For the money spot, we're going to dig it up. And you get 1000 bells when you dig up your money spot. So you're going to open the inventory and this is the thousand bells. Normally you'd bur bury this in the hole and you'd get 3000 bells in a few days. But what you can do is come down here and click 10,000 bells. So now you have a 10 here. Now we're going to bury that in the hole. Now we're going to get 30,000 bells when this grows. Now, you don't want to just plant it here because you're going to have a hard time finding your money trees all over the island. Sometimes they'll be on top of hills and over bridges. And, you know, it just gets to a pain. So what you can do is just hit A with your shovel. You'll dig it up. You don't need to eat fruit because it's a nursery tree. Nursery money tree. See, now it's in your pocket. And what you can do is run over to where you want to put your money trees. There's another fossil. Perfect. That's all of them. We found them all. And let's say I'll just put a, a, my money tree right here. So I'll click here. Plant. And there you go. Now my money tree will grow here. See, this one's growing. Now what you need to be careful of. Remember, I when I was going 
to shake my trees to get the items like i said 17 hardwood trees on your island will offer you something so what i do is when i want to if i shake this tree let me show you if i shake this money tree now i'll get the money but now i have 18 hardwood trees this is now a hardwood tree not a money tree now it's a hardwood tree and i don't want that okay so what i'm gonna do is i'm just gonna cut it down with my axe two three now click oh i don't want to collect the wood i don't have a, my pockets are full <laughs> drop it now what you can do is instead of shaking it first you can just take the axe and chop it down directly okay and then okay i don't have room in my pockets so this is a problem today <laughs> now i'm gonna take the shovel and uh, you can keep the stumps if you want but i don't need these stumps so i'll just dig these out kick up the shovel and now i have spots ready for more money trees yay there you go all right so then what i would do next is after digging up all the i would normally dig up all the fossils remember i'd usually go with an empty backpack so go in here to see blathers and we'll assess our fossils hello all right assess fossils we only have two there we did find five that's good what is he gonna say Ooh, more than one i see let's take a look close shall we indeed quite splendid oh our museum already has these okay so now what i do with all the items i'm collecting the reason i'm collecting all these items is i like to sell them on nukazan to make some extra money you know the items i don't need i can just sell and it's really good money and i think in our next episode in the next episode i'll be going through how i sell on nukazan so next i come here and we're gonna sell the items that we found today not the uh not the furniture items all right welcome all right so talk to tommy welcome on to sell okay i'm gonna sell i'm gonna sell the the fossils now the reason i don't sell fossils on nukazan is because when i'm storing all these items in in my house they still show up as like these skulls and it's really tough to find the item that you sold normally you can see the a picture of the item but here you you only see the skulls and it just it's a pain it's it's a big pain to find the one that i sell so i just sell them here sell the, i only sell the furniture it's much much easier okay so let me sell these and now what i'm gonna do is in this store i'm gonna buy everything that i've never seen before or is in a different color so let me see what's this oh nail art set i have never seen this before so i'm gonna buy it i'll buy it now i'm not sure if i've bought these before so i'm just gonna buy these document stack i'm gonna buy them anyway because i'm not sure all right and i'm what's this monstera i'm gonna buy this I, i've bought a monster before but i'm not sure if the base was a different color so i buy that and i'm gonna buy this what is this we got a nice little toy train pro back container Never seen that before so we'll buy that and this is also something i've never had before looks like the white corner neutral corner i always get the blue the blue corner so i'll buy that now the reason i went and bought everything now you don't have to buy everything if you if you've never had it before then you don't need to buy it but the reason why you want to buy everything at least once is this so we're going to go over to recreation services 
right over here and we're gonna go to the ATM all right we go to this ATM and we're gonna open up the shopping we're gonna see what they're selling and also when you when you go to the ATM you also get 50 miles and then tomorrow you get 80 miles and the next day 100 and you get more and more nook miles every day that you open this okay so we go to nook shopping first and I'm going to look at the special goods. All right, the outdoor table. I've already got this. I don't need it. The portable radio. I've already got. I don't need this. And so that's it. I'm not going to buy anything there. But this is what I was wanting to show you. If you go down here to the catalog, this shows you everything you found in the game. And if you found it once, you can buy it here. Look at um, what did we find today? Let's 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 get it. Um, what did we find? We found the white corner or the neutral corner. Remember the neutral corner? Um, okay, so here we go. We have the blue corner here, which I told you I already got. But if we go, if we go all the way to the bottom. We go to the bottom. And I forget how to do it. Sorry, wrong button. <laughs> if we go down here, uh, N, 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 N. Oh, it's not here. Hmm. Maybe it's the next day it'll show up. But anyway, as you, or I might have to place the item. Let me see if that works. Let's go aside and place the item. This is interesting. I didn't, I'm not sure if it shows up the next day. Or if it's after you place the item. If it's after you place the item, I don't think it's after you place it. I think it's the next day. We'll just do a test here. So we'll go over here. Um, Where's that? Pedal board, Monstera, Color Grinder, Nail Art, Set. Neutral corner. All right. Let's place that. Boom. All right. Got it. <laughs> Pick it up. Let's go back in here. Let's. This is for science. Either way, for sure, one hundred percent. The next day will be it will show up in here because this is such an amazing thing. So we go to Nook Shopping and we go to the catalog and let's go to N. Do, do, do. Let... Oh, there we go. So it's after you place it. So yeah, so I place the item down and now it's here. It's now I can buy this. I can buy this. I can buy three of them. I can buy four of them, but it's always there for me to sell the neutral corner. I can buy this and it'll come in the mail the next day. And like I said, the reason I bought the Monstera, see, it has a brown basket there, but let's here, look at the mountain bike. This comes in different colors. So. You also want to buy each of the color variations. Here we go. Mobile. We have different mobiles. A microscope, different colored microscopes. And some of them have up to five or six different colors or styles, you know? So you want to, you want to buy one of everything so that, you know, later in the game, when you're building your, your city out, you can just come here. Now you can buy up to five items per day. So I can, example if, if i was to buy this lawn chair or lawnmower let's buy something so let's go let's buy this magazine so if i click here buy place order i'll say your order has been placed your order will be delivered shortly it'll arrive tomorrow in the mailbox okay so that's the reason i buy everything from the nook store each day okay all right so let's recap here so the first thing I do is search for the message in a bottle for my DIY. Then I shake my trees. Look for, ah, look for the fossils and the money spot. Okay. Um, I'm, I'm trying to finish the fossils in the museum. I found almost everything. Like there's not many more I need. So I'm almost there. Um, then shake, uh, after I shake the trees, I get my two furniture items. Then I go to the nook shop 
buy any of the uh, sell everything i i've found and then buy anything i haven't bought before then I go to the resident services and you know get my bonus miles for the day check out the shop and yeah and then that's it now there's one more thing i haven't done today is the rocks um the rock one of the rocks on your island will give you money belts okay so we'll do that right after this i just want to assess these fossils normally i would have storage so i don't have to do this twice but this is the way it happened today so more than one i see and they already have these fossils so I'll just sell these later. All right. So the last thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go hit my rocks. Now, I don't always do this. And this is why I left it till last because I don't enjoy it. Plain and simple. I just don't enjoy it. And that's why I don't do it. So, but if you need money so far, we, we've earned, we can earn a lot of money. Remember, if you do this every day, every time this tree grows in three days, you're going to get 30,000 bells. You get about 7,000 from the clams and stuff, the clams and shells. You get about 7,000, 8,000 bells from the trees. And now these rocks, these rocks will, this is it. This is the money one. I was very lucky. I don't normally get it on the first one. There you go. And if you do that, Look at this. 2,000 bells, 8,000 bells, 4,000 bells, 1,000 bells. One, two, they just double each time. Four, and eight. Look at that. And then all these coins here. They're 100. And what you do is you put these stones behind it. Okay? Because every time you hit with the shovel, you get hit back. And these these rocks will stop you from going back. Can't can't go back. Here I have the wall, so I don't need anything. And now normally what I would do, normally it would take me a few tries. Like, okay, this one's rock, so I'd skip it. And then I would run over here to my other rock. This one I have a house behind it, so it's good. Ah, another rock. Don't need that. And I would just go around and to each of my rocks until I found the money rock. So we're really lucky today. Oh, here we go. We got... Not an item. You tricked me. You tricked me. I'm going to catch you for that. Right. Oh, I missed. Too late. <laughs> no, but that is my daily routine. It. Well, look at that. This is another part of the daily routine. You may find the balloon. Oh, that was a mistake. We'll just wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Got it. What can it be? Now, remember, I just knocked these bells down. So I'm going to have to cut this down now. <laughs> I made a mistake, but... I'll have to cut it down now. All right, let's see what that present was. What did we get today? Ooh, yellow leaf pile. Beautiful. I don't have that yet. Sweet. All right. Well, that's my daily routine. Thank you so much for watching. This is my first Animal Crossing video. I'll be putting up more. I think next we'll go to do some sales on Nukazan. I'll be doing some streaming soon. Uh, so stay. Stay tuned. Subscribe. Hit the bell. You know. If you're interested. You've been here this long. It's going to be fun. We're also going to be doing some Let's Play on building the island up. So thank you very much. Have a great day. Bye.